Cade Slinky. Hey people, Cade Slinky here. So I've mentioned in some of my other videos that I am going to cover more Warhammer games on this channel this year and uh, this is one of them. This is Warp Forge which there's a demo that's just come out today which they're calling it a pre-alpha demo so these are subject to change but this is one game that intrigues me to cover in the future. Not sure of a release date yet, I'm not sure if to give one but this is kind of like a combat cards Warhammer-esque kind of game and it does look pretty good so I thought we'd just go through the demo now. It's the first time I've actually played it so it's all new to me as it is to you if you haven't played it already. So we're going to just kick straight in now to the practice. And uh, as you can see a lot of this is going to be locked with it being a demo. So I think in the practice we can do ultramarines or we can do the orcs. So, so let's go have a look at the ultramarines first. Uh, it's always ultramarines. And we have Ventress, who looks like he's going to be the commander of this. So let's just kick straight in and have a look. The graphics look pretty cool for this. So we've got Lord Kalgar here as well talking. Let's fight indeed. So this is the Warlord, he's attack value of 2. So track to the enemy to attack. This looks pretty good. So attack damage equal to your attack value, lowered by your enemy health. Yeah, pretty standard to most card games out there. We'll end the turn. So it's there go now, and he's hitting str straight back as normal. Okay, so my turn again, and it looks like all I can do is again just attack. Oh, we've got the gun there. Let's just go for a normal attack. Looks like it's a two for the gun as well. Did I do that? How if your warlord dies first, you lose. Standard rules. Oh, he's got backup. Close combat is going to tear me apart. So, this is where we're going to use the range. Just that, and then we shoot back. And he's dead. Always choose your attack mode carefully, deal as much damage as you can while taking them as little as return. Okay, looks really good. The graphics are really good for this. The background. So I can draw one card now and hold up to 10 cards at once. So all we've got here. So an incessor. So deploy your incessor while dragging a card into the battlefield. Let's put him there. Okay, this is cool. Newly deployed troops can't attack till next turn. Okay. So we're going for a shoot. I was shooting back as well. So end turn. Oh, it looks like they've got similar again. Okay. Yeah, so we need to do the range attack. Oh. I was saying that to do. Nice. Gonna be close. We're both on quite close health here, but this is the tutorial. Let's bring another card. Can I bring another card yet? Oh dear. Here we go. Here we go. What we got here? Centurion. Playing a card energy each turn. So, oh, won't let me do that. Put that one first. And that one. Okay, we shoot him. We'll end turn now. I think I'll lose that one. 
But we should be alright. We've got... Um, here we go. We've got more. There we go. I've got to put a centurion up now. So he's got seven range. Take a lot of damage, but Kuro Slam for his fight this time. So you don't need to attack every turn. Sometimes it's wiser to hold back. He's telling me to attack him. And he's dead. Okay. So it looks like when you shoot, you get to kind of shoot back. Here we go. Going to finish. This should finish him off. Good student. All the orcs are coming. And we've won. There we go. Victory. That was just a tutorial and it seemed pretty standard. Let's have a look at the orcs tutorial now. With Gazgul. Okay, and we're in the orc base, it looks pretty good. Okay. Oh, we're getting another card straight off. Makari the Grot. So most units have special abilities. Makari gives adjacent units a melee attack bonus. Okay. So put him there. And he should have an attack bonus. Yeah, he's hitting harder. And turn. Okay. It's him back, but we're looking good in health. Oh, we've got another grot. <laughs> we're going to put him there. The orc tide trait lets you play multiple copies of the same card this turn. Okay, cool. That's it now, we're building an orc army now. So, should be able to attack with him. We're getting the melee up. And that's our turn over. The turn counter looks like it's here, so one of three. Just can't do much more there. They seem to be building some troops now. Oh, there's one grot gone. Okay, we can get. Macari to grot back. Click on the card, see what it does. Hover over the trait to see its definition. Try it with Macari. Okay, so you can just click on the card and see what it does that way. So it's only a little grot, it's not going to do much. But it should say, does it see on the back? Oh, it says there. So adjacent units have what, plus one melee attack. Backlash, return this troop to your hand. Okay. Oh, we've got this one as well. What's this? Uh, shooter boy. Deal one damage to a random enemy. Let's put him down. And let's put another grot down. Probably should have best actually. Can we swap them around? No. Probably should have best putting the grot next to uh, Gaskull. But um, we shall go for. That. Can he go for them? Oh, nice. That's pretty good. His skill. So it deals a one damage to a random enemy every time. Okay, cool. It's okay. Okay, what's this card we got now? Deal three damage to a random enemy. Oh, that's even better than evil. Stratagems are special cards have an instant effect on a battle. So let's pull that down. <laughs> That's ace. Okay, so we've used that already. Okay. 
and turn. Oh, they've got Vanguard. Which looks like it's given some shield. Okay, we've got a war boss now. That looks ace. And a slugger boy. So, can we put him down? Or we letting us put that one down? It looks like we can put another one down. And this one as well. Okay, that looks like it's give us. Um, what's that? What did that do then? Shoot him. Definitely outnumbered him now. Hmm. Oh, here he is again. So, gives one plus one melee and one plus one range attack to your troops. Okay, let's just put him there. Right, let's give that to the boss this time. Okay, gives it to everyone. And when I went down here, we are building up an army now. It should be. Uh, should we do some melee? Just in a random. Um, shoot. I was going to shoot back and kill him. And I think that's my turn over. This time I'll put him next to the boss because he's going to get a plus one melee. And I think they're nearly dead. I think it's time to end turn that time. Should get one the next time. We put down now is that a vanguard? It's more shield. Okay, we might take some characters here, but we should win the next round. Got Macrot, the Grot. Oh yes, look at it. I think we put this down. It should uh, kill him. Kill that one anyway. Put him there. And then we'll go for melee, and that should be game over. Fall back and regroup. That was a nice and easy tutorial. The orcs look pretty good, actually. They look quite good to uh, to play. I think that's all of the practice have we got. Actually, now we've got the. Or should we just go and kick off into a multiplayer? And let's have a look at. Let's have a look at a multiplayer. We can. Um, can we go into multiplayer? I've got to go through all tutorials first. Tutorial one, two. I think it looks like we might have to go through all tutorials first. And okay, we we'll go for the Necrons then. Let's see what these can do. Again, the, the background looks really cool. Oh, they're getting first turn. And I've got a Necron Warrior, is that? That's the same for me. Okay, we've got some choices. Relentless March, deploy Necron Warrior. We've got Triarch there, he looks cool. Can I put him down? I don't know, I've only got three powers, so. It's not telling me to do that though, it's only telling me to uh, do that because it's tutorial. Many Necron troops have the remnant skill. When killed, they leave a remnant on the board. Is that can, they can probably uh, regen. I'm gonna do that. We've got Necron Warrior and end the turn. So 
So there we go. So they've got the, the, the regen. Wow, and he's actually skilled up better. Reanimated, that's the word I was after. With certain cards and abilities, some units trigger a special effect when he animated, which looks like that's why it's, he looks a bit more tougher. Okay, it's my turn. What we got? Lots to choose from, but it's only let me do this one. I want to kind of get stuck in and use different cards, but it's a tutorial, so it's telling me now to shoot. Shoot the laser. And it's telling me to... I think I can either shoot or melee that guy. This guy's got a shield now, but we'll end the turn. Wow, he's just vaporized him. And he's vaporized him back. But it could be reanimated. Oh wow, what's that they've just put down? Just one of the flayed ones. Frenzied. When we animated again, flank. Wow, okay. So, reanimation protocol on him. There we go. And now he's a bit more stronger. Now we've got one of the warriors. When we animated, gain two ranged attack. So, we're going to put him forward. And now we're going to kill that flayed one. Yes. Attack of the warrior. Needs to get his health down a bit more. Let's kill him back. Only running play until the end of the owner's turn. Okay. End turn of that one. So the Necrons is a lot of reanimated uh, going on, which is pretty cool. Which is standard to work uh, their 40k uh, play. The animations are really cool for this game. Oh wow, okay. We are, um, okay, they've lost theirs. <laughs> We've got a lot of reanimating to do here. Um, what's this guy? A Technomancer. So we're going to put him forward. Troops with Archie trigger an effect when you play stratagem. Okay. Reanimate that one. Oh, cool. It reanimates them all. Right, so we're going to kill him. And that's our turn done. But we are looking in good position here. Until they bring down whatever that is. Oh, it's a scythe. Okay. So, it's saying we, we should kill the scythe by the looks. Either by shooting or melee. And it just killed his back. You're going to shoot that guy there. Attack on damage in the remnant will destroy it. Ah, oh, okay. So, it stops it from reanimating. There we go. Now it's asking me to put the plasmancer. There was free damage to a random enemy. Oh, take that. End turn. Don't seem to be doing much damage apart from taking out the troops this time, but we are building up a bit more of an army. He's hitting back, and he should be dead now. Carry on playing and finish off the opponent. Here we go. So, let's... Wake him up. And yeah, let's do some shooting with him. He did some good damage. And. Can I do anything with him? No. Shoot with him. Well, that takes 10. But. Let's put another troop in there. 
think that's my turn done. Oh, I can shoot with him. And he's died. It's end of turn. Should be able to finish him off more or less next turn or turn after. Finished him off. Okay, it's just done something. What we got here to choose? Sniper, oh, look at him, he does five wood, put him down. And the lightness march. Bring that there. Oh, because obviously I placed him down, he can't do anything this time. But he can do some damage there. He can do some shooting damage. Could do a clear nap, preferably. That should be able to finish him off. And he's obviously hit him back. But now this guy here, my sniper, should be able to finish the main guy off. What we got first? Reanimator. Let's put these down. And let's just finish it off now. They're cool. Um, this should be it. Game over. There we go. And that's a Necron tutorial done. And join again, don't forget to add to your wishlist on Steam. Okay. So I think that's all. Okay, look, it's opened up. Wow, it's opened, opened up the clans now. Okay, now we can go into multiplayer. So let's have a multiplayer to finish the video off. What are we gonna go on? Um, I did like the orcs to be fair. These must be different decks to play. Um, Goth is the best, we try that. So we're searching for player now, so this is going to be, I'm guessing, live against someone. Choose cards to replace in your first hand. Um, let's just continue, I think, for now. Don't really know. Probably just going to get battered here, but... Okay, so give plus two melee to your attack units this turn. Can't really. What was that? Get camouflage. Or do I put the goth down? Let's put the goth down. And do a hit. So that's turn ended. I'm guessing I'm playing against a human now. I don't think this is. Uh, it's probably someone pretty good as well. There we go, my turn. What cards we got? He's really good, wasn't he? Because he gives the plus one melee. Let's definitely put him down. And we've got two more points to spend. Put him down as well. Nice. So that's give me five attack for him. Oh no, it's melee, sorry. Five melee, so that should do some damage there. And he's gone. This is again, I can get three melee off this guy. Um, let's do that. I've just put him down, so it can't be done. There we go. I seem to be... <laughs> they don't seem to be playing many cards. They're just going to just place loads of cards. But they're playing this really well. Thinking about it. Here we go. What's he doing? Okay. 
Okay. My turn. So, definitely put him in there again because he can do some good damage. Gives camouflage to your troops. Oh. Yeah, this guy's really good, to be fair. Um, that leaves me a point spare for next time. Um, can't really put any more down, so we're just going to have to go straight for the melee. On. I'm going to kill him, so we'll just go take some more off the boss. And that's it. Yeah, wow, he's hitting back hard. Don't seem to be putting... I think they must be saving their points for a good card. He's thinking about it. Here we go, what's this card? I have a feeling this guy I'm playing is a bit more experienced than me. So now we've got five. Gives two melee attack to your units this turn. He's pretty good. So troops cost two less this turn. Mm. So two less, that'd be three. Ah. Kind of want to feel, feel like I should less leave that till next time. So deploy three grots. That's pretty good. And so we do that. And let's put some strength in numbers down. There we go. So this time we can finish him off. Yeah, let's finish him off. Oh, timed. Anyway, that's it done. That's good. So you've got you've got a timer for your turn, so you're not going to take too long thinking about it. I don't know how long you get. Wow. That was a good card. It just killed everyone. Oh dear. oh dear, this is not looking good now. Okay, what have we got here? How can we bring this back here? Create a slugger boy in your hand. That's going to use all of my points. Um. Oh dear. So we put that one there. That one there. Got three left. Shall I use a camouflage or shall I use. Let's put a goth can. Okay, now I can have a charge at. Finish this guy off, I think. Oh wow, I've got 15 on me. I don't think it's looking good for me now. Reanimate. Yeah, I'm only on 15 health. He's on 21, so I do think he has the upper hand. What's he going to do? What cards are you going to play? Thinking about it. Oh no, it was killed on me. One of my grots. Just give myself health as well. Wow. <laughs> okay. Oh man. Destroy all troops in play. That will literally use all of my 
points. What's this I've got here? I don't think I'm I don't think I'm playing this right to be fair, but let's put him down. I kind of hope. Let's get rid of that. I'm only down to I'm ten health compared to twenty. I think uh, this is kind of game over now. He's played it quite well, and he's thinking about it a lot more than me. Deploy free random, hey all. Wow, that's a good card. Look at um, I'm in trouble now. Big trouble. Oh, mind you, I could play that next time and destroy all troops, but it's not going to help me with. Uh, Oh, yeah. Play that. Just look at the animation. That looks hazy. Awesome. And we'll play that. Just to get some more health off him. He's going to hit me back anyway. So. End the turn. I've kind of lost this, to be fair. But the animations don't look pretty good. Is that going to reanimate all of them? Wow. I need a miracle now. I really do. Um, should we play that last? Yeah, what's this? Um, let's just play loads of troops. Infantry. Clan. Let's play the camouflage. See what that does. Um, he's going to kill me next time, but we'll just kill him, I think. And see how we get on. You could probably more or less kill me, to be fair. A couple more. Is that another? Oh, wow. That's a great card for the Necrons. Uh, he can definitely just finish me off now. But he's not. He's going to wait. No, he's killed me. <laughs> okay. Game over. As predicted. But there we go. Wow. Um, yeah, I definitely need to do some more practice in this game. Um, but it was good. That's really good. The graphics are really good for it the gameplay feels really good it feels really smooth it kind of uh, flows really well um it's got to, got to learn your decks i think i think that guy definitely knew what he was doing with them necrons they look pretty good to be fair the necrons but for a demo it's quite good it's quite quite a good chance to really have a feel for the game um you can get this demo on steam I think it's free on there. Um, I don't know how long for, so if you've got Steam on your PC, um, get it downloaded and give it a go. Um, but there you are, it's a bit of a taste of it. I'm definitely going to more, need more practice and play this a bit more. And hopefully in the future, um, get the game and do a lot more videos in the future. So please don't forget to check out some of my other videos on, uh, on my channel for Warhammer. And I've also got more Warhammer games coming soon. So thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.